In this video, I show you how to change your Apple ID on your iPhone. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's go and jump straight into this guide. Here we are on my iPhone and let's go and get into this guide of changing the Apple ID, which is currently on your device. So basically switching to another account because maybe you've made a new one or there may be another reason. But what you want to do is go and open up the settings app just like so. And then what you need to do is go and tap on your name at the top like so. And this is gonna take you to your Apple ID iCloud settings settings basically so tap here so there's a few things we need to do before we actually go and transition to a different account so the first thing you want to do is go and tap on find my in the second section of the apple id settings and what i recommend doing is disabling find my iphone because essentially this is a link to your current apple id and icloud account so it's definitely worth turning this off so press on the switch and then what you need to do is go and enter your password and then press turn off i've now going to turn mine off so then what we can do is go back to the main apple id settings and now the next thing you need to do is just scroll right to the bottom of the apple id page and just before we press sign out you're probably thinking I've got a lot of things like photos, contacts and things like that all stored on iCloud and I want them to be on my phone and I'm signing out so I'm going to lose them. Don't worry, everything is going to make sense. All you need to do is go and press sign out like so. Then it's going to go and take a moment to load and as you can see we've now got this option here saying keep a copy of your data on this iPhone. Data removed from this iPhone will still be available in iCloud. All items will be removed from wallet. So what you want to do is go and choose everything you want a copy of. In my case, I'd like things like um, contacts, um, calendar as well, because I've got information in there. So basically go and enable everything you'd like to go and have a copy of on this iPhone to keep. Um, so you can keep this information on your iPhone when you go and sign in to another Apple ID. Then all you need to do is press sign out, just like so in the top right. And as you can see this, are you sure? It may take a minute to remove your iCloud data from this iPhone, so go and press sign out. Then it's going to be copying the iCloud data to your device. And then you'll be taken back to this page here, but if you go and swipe back like so, then go and press on it again. As you can see, it looks slightly different. And then all you need to do is press sign out again like so. And as you can see, we're now fully signed out. And it says set up iCloud, the app store and more. So tap here. Then you can go and sign into your other Apple ID or your iCloud account and you can go and start using it. And you have kept all the information from your other Apple ID on your device. If you guys found this useful, please go down below and leave me a like. Peace.